How's it going, chicks, mates? This is Mr. Charles, and we're here with Anna Extended Edition. Now, most of Anna Extended Edition is extended with a ton of bullshit. Like the fact a cigarette lighter is the purest flame. I want this pure flame back in the water, please. No, put it back in the water. Sorry, right, I just like the light being down there for some reason, but we'll ignore that. Um, but we won't ignore the fact that A, the book keeps coming up when I put that down there. And B, this game can be utter bullcrap. Okay, so I made a ritual knife. Oh, okay, and the same entry keeps appearing with the electron things. Every time I put it down, I get the new note. Okay, so the new note I have, which isn't it worked, I don't know how. I assembled a ritual knife. I haven't any clue about its origins, but I'm certain it's ancient. The weirdest thing is that when I put the blade together, it reacts to the heat of my hand. Alright, so I think I know what this means. I've got to stab myself, which is lovely. Ugh. I don't want to do this, but... Ow. Huh? Oh, do I put it in the water first? Because this water is pure. No? And this is why I'm happy this game has a guide. I clean the water. I imagine it would be useful for celebrating a kind of ritual. What did that book say about... Isn't this exactly what happened before? Oh, come on! Cold ritual dagger. What does it take for a man to stab himself? So I've got a bleed in the water. Unless this water's not good enough. No, I don't want to drink water. What do I do? This is so dumb. It has to be this water. There's candles around it and everything. I was so certain that you stab yourself with the knife. Also, that girl's crying has been just echoing throughout the game. It's actually pure agony because... I literally just know every every single little detail of that cry. And it's really just etched into my brain now. Alright, maybe... I don't want to do this again. But maybe that light shouldn't be down there. So now I can do it? Water. Uh... Called rid... Yeah, with the water. No? With the... With the... With the water... Oh, come on! Alright, there is something else I can do. Admittedly, I don't want to do this. But, I can increase the help level. So I'm going to do that. But I'm only going to do it for this hint. I'm just going to see what the hell this game is on about. And then, yeah. I clean the water, I might be useful for so yeah. What that book says? Oh, if I remember correctly, the next passage says to pour blood onto the ray of light. Wait, if I remember correctly, the next passage... Okay, I have to use some kind of red-hot ceremonial knife. Oh, did it cool down as I argued how stupid it was? Oh! Oh, okay. Well, that's baloney then. Oh, don't add that entry again, man. We don't need that entry. In fairness, whilst I was editing, I heard a hissing noise... But I thought it was something that was trying to disturb my sanity. So I'll switch that back to simple. Okay, that was my fault. Admittedly, metals do cool down after a certain period of time. That's fair. I'm not going to criticise that. I'm just going to criticise every other little thing. No, just burn it. Okay. Snake, cool. Then I stab myself. No, stab myself. I don't think this is the right place. We're at a puddle, man. What more do you want? Uh, hello? Oh, God. Oh, come on. What do you mean you don't think this is the right place? We're right at a puddle. It's called... Okay, what if I put it on the water? No? Person. This is the right place. Where else do you want me to go? Oh, unless it's, like, here? Oh, we have to put in the rev light, don't we? Oh, that's nice. Are we going to hell? Oh. Well, now I regret to... Oh. I should have put a flashing image thing, I guess. 
Uh, who? Who are you talking to here? Oh! I think my sanity's decreased again. I think that's what I meant. What was that about some someone running off? I saw something before my eyes. The house trembled. I'm scared. Alright. Hey, I know. Why don't we keep exploring the house? We could exit the house if we wanted to, to be fair. I'm not going to do that, though. So, what's the next thing? The book talks about touching the face of the innocents. On the painting says two figures almost rubbed off. What paintings? I thought you were talking about like the two boys over there, like Castor and Pollux. Paintings? Oh! Wait, when were these here? There's a niche carved onto the wall. There's something painted inside. Oh, this did something. Also, Clegg's online. Okay. God, I love being in America where we have some lovely earthquakes. Why aren't you eating? Cause. Yeah. Has something happened? She's so hungry, that's all. Alright. Whoa, we've got some proper EastEnders happening here. Okay. It doesn't work now. Well, is that how paintings work? Are they meant to speak? I didn't know that. Alright, can I actually figure this out for myself? Ritual! No. Uh, alright, what now? I imagine I will have to do something with those paintings that appeared in the niches. The writing on the wall near the stove could be hiding the solution. Well, I'm sorry. I'm not really looking around that much anymore. I'm hoping the game can just solve itself. This is an extended edition, after all. The death was black, the hatred bronzed, the happiness golden, the solitude silvery, yet the sole lie was white. Why is everyone online and offline at 4am in the morning? Yeah, I know this is what it says. Yeah, the one lie was white. What are you talking about? Was there something I've got to select here? There's a niche carved into the wall. There's something painted inside. Yeah, I know that. Is there something I'm meant to select here, maybe? Well, what was red? Nothing. This, what are you on about? There's like just millions of red. Oh, okay, hold on. What happened to um? Also, was that red before? Okay, cool. Something happened over here. Well, there's a another painting here. That's interesting. There's a niche. Something painted inside. All right. I don't actually know if these images mean anything. I have to do something with those paintings that appeared in the niches. The writing on the wall near the stove could be hiding the solution. The hatred... Oh, God! I know I could just go for the full guide and then just, you know, wing it. But I'm not going to do that. Because I should actually learn how to play this game. Happiness golden, the solitude silvery, yet the soul lie was white. Can I stab the wall? No? I stab anything. Oh, the leaves! Don't pollute. Yeah, well, don't I need to use the leaves somehow? Can I not. Oh, come on. Use the leaves. Use the goddamn leaves! No? Well, because it's saying five colours, right? These are... A fair amount of colours. I guess not all of them, though. I don't know. Can I not just cut these tied leaves up? No. Ah! Uh... Oh! I cut the rope. I've got five leaves now. Finally, thank you. Oh, and I've completely filled my second wheel. That's good. So black, white, bronze, silver, golden. There we go. So it is a leaf puzzle. I just used the wrong knife. I don't know how that's stupid. The death was black, the hatred bronze, the happiness golden, the solitude silvery, 
Yet the sole lie was why. So what goes where? Excuse me? Okay, cool. So there's five paintings, I imagine. This game likes its number five, doesn't it? Then... Think about someone leaving there. Right, the death was black. Well, someone's dying here. So do I use this here? Uh, okay. Well, that was good for my sanity. The hatred bronzed. Well, that's hatred because of pitchforks and stuff. So that could go bronze. The happiness golden. These guys seem happy, but those faces there don't. Golden? The Solitude Silvery. And then something was a lie. I think I've messed up somewhere here. I think that must be Solitude. So that has to be Silvery. But that makes this a lie. What could possibly be a lie about this? Oh! I heard something like... The seal's not... Oh! Okay! I solved the leaf puzzle! Oh, God! No, I've got to know. Who's in here? My love. My wooden figure. Woman-shaped mannequin. Are you okay? An obscene woman-shaped mannequin. It doesn't seem to be handcrafted. It appears to have grown in that shape. As if it were a plant. Huh. That was what was behind here. I never thought I could hate an inanimate object so much. But that thing, that imitation of a woman, that foul piece of wood, has awoken in me an inexplicable repulsion. Pestle mortar. Huh. So that was what was behind here. So I'm just kind of shocked. I would have thought it would be like a reveal at the end or something. Room is full of dust and smoke. I can't get in. To be fair, guys, I am kind of considering it at this point. I kind of just want to know what was in this house. Um. But first things first, I want to light this this candle. The lamp is empty. I have to find something. Yeah, well, I just picked up some oil from Tesco. Yeah, yeah. I just ducked. No. Yes. Yeah. I've got a light bulb. Oh. Or maybe it's not pure enough. But I don't have any more of that crap, do I? Um. Do I burn the woman? Okay, give me a hint. I must find a way to get rid of that heart once and for all. What heart? I could burn it, but the stove is broke. What heart? There's no heart. Oh, wait, can I take that ring? It's a wedding ring. It looks shining clean. Oh, am I going to steal her wedding ring? Is she going to follow me now? Alright, well I didn't mind her before, but now I'm kind of worried about her. Maybe I should leave this house. I am contemplating the idea. Although if I do do that, then I might like come back to this game later, I don't know. So, hold on, I've got to fix this, but I can't. So I've got to get rid of the heart. I could burn it, but the stove is broken. So, have I got what I need to fix the stove now? Not really. And also, what do you mean heart? There is no heart. I've got nothing to fix it with. The hint isn't being very handy at the moment. Um, I don't know what the heart is. I don't know if, like, maybe I've skipped a step or something, but... I can't get through this dark barrier, can I? Oh, well, I can. Oh, well, no, I can only go so far. Okay. There's nothing I can take. That's fair. I don't think I want to go in that dark barrier. I think I'm finding the light barrier of lightness and nice stuff. You know what? I think I'm going to end the episode here. But 
I want to end the episode with knowing what happens if you go through the front door. Do you really want to flee? If I left, I feel as though I wouldn't be able to enter the house again. I mean, at this point, if I really, really, like, under all conditions, save deleted, can't ever play the game again, to be fair, I know what's behind the door now, so I'm kind of fine with that. So yes, I want to know what happens, you know? And to be fair, there's multiple endings in this game. Like, I know there's a true ending, but this is like the chicken ending. And I want to know what the chicken ending is. So what happens? What's the conclusion? We've left the place now, so... You know, give it to me straight. This place gives me the creeps. Something horrible must happen here. Good English. Air feels filled with horror. I must leave. Yeah, but I can't really go anywhere, can I? I've got, like, a gate I can go through or something? What was I seeking in a place like that? What was I hoping to find? Um, a wooden mannequin that was female? Distinctly female? Between these walls and these woods, there's nothing for me. Only madness was waiting behind those doors. Okay. Staying there means only pain. Horrible secrets unveiled, and I could have lost myself. Well, you could have, or maybe you couldn't have. I want to leave and forget this place. Forget everything forever. Alright, you have some deep regrets, man, which is keeping me attached to this game, but okay. Oh, everything's going dark, but there's still a white cloud. Okay, end of game recap. Uh, oh god, I missed out a lot, didn't I? I only read five books. Not much of a reader, am I? I witnessed three events. I got a good decision ending. Okay, was it good if, like, I, um, didn't bother? If I didn't bother playing this game, would that have been better than playing this game? So this is the first ending. Uh... What is the Sabbath Maker's Way? It said it once when I read the book, like, for sealing magic and stuff, but after that I don't really know what the Sabbath Maker's Way was. Okay, well, that was the Coward's Way of playing Anna Extended Edition. Um, I think I will get back to this game. I'm gonna try and invest some time in it, maybe get all the endings, I'm not sure yet, it depends what I can be asked with. But either way, I want to make sure I get the true ending to this game, you know, when you find out who Anna was, what happened, did she die, was she actually our daughter, was she actually, I don't know, a girl that we liked but never liked us back, I don't know. But you know what, I am interested by the story, if anything. The graphics, yeah, the puzzles, goddamn annoying, but the story, I have to admit, is very, very intriguing. So it better not be a disappointing true ending. But yeah, as I said, don't know when I'm going to be back with this game, so if you want to play the game for yourself, you can go on PlayStation now. $12.99 a month for some quality gaming. And without further ado, look for my book, subscribe to my channel. Until next time, see ya.